Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to get the light section of the Whisper of the Worm mission for the catalyst stuff done. It's very simple. So before you even get to that, it's going to tell you to get 10 uh, kills with the weapon on taking enemies in order to get to the blights. That's really easy. Just load up Shirochi as you see here and get 10 kills to unlock the the next step in your quest line so next you're going to load in and immediately when you load in it's not going to be very far you don't have to go far i know some people thought it was the different brights but it's more like the eyeballs so you see them right there so as you can see you cannot shoot them while not using the whisper of the worm so you got to make sure you bring the whisper of the worm there is three of them in this area you see there's one directly ahead the other one will be a little further back. You'll see it here. Sorry, I shoot it a little bit there with the recluse. And there will be a third. So remember, bring the Whisper of the Worm. There's three of them here. Once we get, uh, get the Whisper of the Worm on, you can switch the weapons on. It doesn't matter if it's normal or legends. Pretty simple. Just make sure you throw the Whisper of the Worm on. And once you shoot them, you'll see the progress complete once you get all of them the third one is on the tree there just look up above fire that's all three that's the that's all you need for this week is those three as far as i can tell if anything changes i will let you know next i'm going to show you where the hidden items are we did find a couple of secrets here it's going to be really simple to get to it's not really far from the beginning as well so don't go too crazy you're just gonna go up the top here, take out the blight, as you see happening here. Like I said, don't go too far, All right? It's really close. Make sure you take out this blight, drop down the hole. You're just gonna keep going straight down here. Okay. It's really, really close to here. Just keep going straight. Then you're gonna take a left once you get past this jump here, and you're gonna go all the way to the back corner there. It is pretty dark, so watch out. Just get to the corner here and you're gonna see the item right there uh we did run into an issue where like it was only giving it to one person that's shooting it so if you're in a fire team beware because it may not give you the credit so you can just always load it back in and then just run back to the spot and then shoot it again it gives me it gave me two of the nail upgrades one person got three one person got one it, it's kind of all over the place i think that's just a bug but that is the location now if we move a little bit forward uh, now we're going to go towards the, uh, the ship unlocks. There is a, there's a little secret room that's pretty easy to miss. As long as you get past the end of the jumping puzzle here, if you go up towards the elevator, don't, don't immediately turn in after you go through the elevator, you're going to keep going straight. Okay. So remember, don't turn immediately. Keep going straight. This one could be really easy to miss. So make sure when you go inside, start shooting it. And there you go. You'll get your, your ship stuff. And that's going to be it. Again, thank you everybody for watching. Appreciate you. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks again. I'll catch you guys on the next one.